songs. Maybe those Spanish stories weren't just legends, because that's what a real lost city looks like. Setting one zero one two. That's Ciudad Perdida, the lost city. Ciudad Perdida, the lost city, is high up in Colombia's most isolated mountain range, the Sierra Nevada. Archaeologists have spent decades exploring this dense jungle to find out about the people who lived here over 500 years ago. Digital technology will help them reveal more and faster. <laughs> Only the world's toughest archaeologists can handle this terrain. Santiago Geraldo has been excavating here for 20 years. <laughs> it's a beautiful place. It's amazing this place is still standing. Who discovered it? It was Guaqueros, looters. And then the archaeologists came in, took them about a week to get here, and uh, they were led by uh, other looters. Looters led the way, huh? Yeah, it's uh, actually pretty incredible because they, were, they got into a shotgun fight. The looters were after the gold that's in the burials. And one looter came out with, uh, you know, more than 80 pieces of gold from one burial. Yeah. Gunfights for gold. Archaeology gets dangerous when gold is involved. And this place is bursting with it. Who built all this? It was the people that we call the Tairona. Their predecessors began to be built around 600 AD. <laughs> It's huge. How many people would have lived here? About two to 3,000 at its peak. And then about 10,000 people living in the upper part of the basin. 10,000? Yeah. All that forest that you see would have been all farmland. Oh man, you can almost feel their energy here, you know, like all these people running around. It's taken us over 40 years of work to clear out and survey the site, trying to tease out what these people were thinking when they were building it. 40 years? Yeah. 